In the world of action anime, Hunter x Hunter is a big standard bearer. The manga series, written by Yoshihiro Togashi, ran from 1998 until 2018 and is currently on hiatus. And my favorite character in the series is none other than Hisoka Moro, also known as the Grim Reaper. He is one of the primary villains in the Hunter x Hunter anime slash manga series. But how would this clown of death fare in the One Piece world? Would he be KO'd in the One Piece universe? Or would he dominate the One Piece world? Stay tuned to find out. Hisoka Moro is a licensed hunter, international criminal slash serial murderer, and heaven's arena floor master obsessed with court jester dress and magic trick aesthetics. During his second attempt to obtain his hunter's license, he is presented to the heroes and the fans. He is enormously strong, ruthless, self-absorbed, and rash. His role in the franchise is fluid, as he is introduced as an antagonist, but frequently joins the protagonist's pranks when it suits him. Hisoka does not appear in every series arc. He often occurs unexpectedly, leaving the audience to learn his part in the story alongside the heroes. As a result, he's both unpredictable and fascinating. Hisoka's objectives are deceptively simple. He's fascinated with finding formidable opponents to confront and defeat to the point of medical need. Hisoka becomes a hunter, a somewhat ambiguous rank in the series that grants its bearers freedom to pursue their desires, fighting and killing with impunity. He joins the Phantom Troop, a crime organization, to eventually meet its commander in combat. He lets Gon and his companion survive on multiple occasions when he easily might have killed them because he feels they will become a larger challenge if allowed to grow. Everything else, including Hisoka's few pleasant relationships and his mortal life, is secondary to his drive to combat the strongest people in the world. A character with a single intrinsic goal would logically be easy to predict, it could be thought that Hisoka will take whatever action leads to a good fight, but he manages to be more nuanced than he appears. In terms of actual physical power, Hisoka is portrayed as a brutal murderer and one of the series' strongest Nen users. For those who may be wondering what Nen is, well, Nen is the core power system in Hunter x Hunter. It allows a person to manipulate their life energy, also known as their aura, and use it to create Nen techniques unique to them. You can say it's the same as hockey in One Piece. Hisoka's strategic approach in battle has been the basis for his triumphs, as he can plan two or three steps ahead of his opponents when executing an assault. He also boasts tactical combat skills, which he combines with Nen when performing his moves, making him a fearsome foe. Hisoka is so powerful that he is known to have killed Bushidoro, a single-star blacklist hunter and former Phantom Troop member. His reputation as a powerful Nen user follows him wherever he goes, and even members of the Phantom Troop are wary of coming into contact with him. As a powerful magician, Hisoka can use Nen in his tricks when attacking or defending. Aside from his combat abilities and skills, he has rapid reflexes that allow him to act quickly and escape impending strikes. He could halt and catch the spinning blades hurled towards him easily in one bout against Togari, which surprised Togari because it took Togari half a year to see his blades. Hisoka can also track down his targets and improve his vision by utilizing Nen. When it comes to fighting, his confidence in his strategic approach propels him to the top of the game. Hisoka also has remarkable awareness and acute senses. During a fight, he could identify the hidden existence of Castro's double and take out the double to defeat Castro. He can also predict and estimate an individual's power by looking at them. Despite his tiny stature, Hisoka possesses tremendous power and can combine his Nen to increase his strength in specific situations. His speed and increased reflexes allow him to move quickly and his speed and reflexes provide him the edge needed to win bounce by allowing him to catch weapons hurled at him, such as Goto's coins, with his signature move, Bungie Gum. Hisoka can utilize his playing cards as projectile weapons or blades by targeting his opponent's weak points by employing the power of Nen. He's undetected while using stealth, which allows him to spy on and track down his targets. He manipulates his aura with special abilities, such as bungee gum, to create elastic strands that can be used as an assault. Hisoka is a transmuter, which means he can alter both rubber and gum qualities with his aura at the same time. Although this may not appear to be a particularly potent talent, Hisoka's planned application can be rather lethal. 
Hisoka's egotistical demeanor is a fan favorite due to his unexpected nature and ability to appear secretive yet deceptive. While viewed as an adversary in the Hunter x Hunter series, he is nevertheless one of the series' most powerful villains. As this great villain is chilling in his lair, fantasizing about Gon and Killua, he suddenly is teleported into the Grand Line by an unknown source, and his first minutes in this strange environment are filled with both fascination and danger. Hisoka's keen senses quickly noticed that he'd wandered into a world full of powerful people, each one a potential opponent to fulfill his voracious hunger for combat. Hisoka felt as if he had been teleported into his own private heaven. Hisoka grinned, knowing he needed to improve his skills to live in this unknown world. He dedicated himself to mastering the delicate skill of Haki, the enigmatic spirit that pervaded One Piece's world. He polished his skills with tenacity, immersing himself in the three types of Haki, Armament Haki, Observation Haki, and Conqueror's Haki. Hisoka's Nen-infused aura gave him an advantage in adjusting to these techniques, allowing him to grow incredibly. Hisoka's fame increased within the Grand Line as the months went into years. His clashes with formidable opponents became legendary, and his striking aura garnered the interest of other factions and organizations. During one of his adventures, he discovered the enigmatic Cross Guild, a hidden group of skilled individuals with objectives as complicated as his own. Hisoka was drawn to the guild's attitude of embracing disorder and questioning the established order, and the potential of both turmoil and formidable opponents piqued his interest. Also, he wanted to infiltrate the guild and fight its Yonko class leaders. His association with the Cross Guild seemed like a logical next step for a guy who thrived on mystery and fighting. He rose through the ranks, bringing his unique combat skills to their unorthodox pursuits, making him similar to Mihawk in how he operated for the guild, a lone wolf sort of vibe. Hisoka's confrontations were even more heated and thrilling within the Cross Guild. He fought notorious pirates, legendary marines, and even enigmatic Yonko characters. Each confrontation fueled his insatiable thirst for adventure, driving him to hone his skills and methods constantly. Hisoka Moro had discovered his playground in this new realm, where oceans contained infinite treasures and the spirit of adventure was tangible. Thanks to his Nen-infused hockey mastery and association with the Cross Guild, he became a force to be reckoned with, a wild card in a world already full of surprises. Due to this, he gained a total bounty of 2.65 billion barracks. In his unending pursuit of powerful adversaries, Hisoka Moro's attention was drawn to rumors of the fearsome Red Hair Pirates, led by the legendary Shanks. Intrigued by tales of Shanks' prowess and his position as one of the Yonko, Hisoka set out to track down this elusive crew, envisioning a thrilling confrontation that would test his newfound mastery of hockey. Hisoka's journey led him through treacherous seas and uncharted islands, each step fueling his excitement for the impending clash. However, fate has a way of twisting one's intentions. As Hisoka delved deeper into the world of pirates, he came across whispers of another name that intrigued him even more. Monkey D. Luffy, captain of the Straw Hat Pirates. The tales of Luffy's audacity, his unwielding spirit, and the astonishing feats he had accomplished captured Hisoka's attention in a way he hadn't expected. The potential for a truly exhilarating battle had shifted from Shanks to this young pirate. Hisoka's obsession with Luffy grew as he gathered information about the Straw Hat crew's adventures. From the cataclysmic events at Annie's lobby to the chaotic escapades in Dressrosa, Luffy's reputation as a force to be reckoned with became increasingly evident. The images of Luffy's confrontations and his explosive devil fruit abilities ignited a fire within Hisoka. He saw in Luffy the kind of opponent he had always craved, one who would push him to his limits and beyond. Swirling in a vortex of anticipation, Hisoka redirected his course, abandoning his pursuit of the Red Hair Pirates. Instead, he focused all his energies on tracking down Luffy and the Straw Hat crew. Every clue, every rumor, and every piece of information became a breadcrumb leading him closer to his desired confrontation. The prospect of facing Luffy in battle consumed his thoughts, his every move dictated by the anticipation of their clash. Hisoka's hockey-enhanced senses detected the subtle tremors of Luffy's presence in the distance, each step bringing him closer to his obsession. And then, at long last, the moment arrived. 
The clash between Hisoka and Luffy was imminent, and the world seemed to hold its breath in anticipation of the collision between two titanic forces. The moment had arrived, and the outcome of this encounter would reverberate through the annals of history. The curtain rose on a battle that would redefine the limits of strength and determination, leaving all witnesses in awe of the spectacle that was about to unfold. Well, that's it for today. Who do you think would win in a fight between hockey-powered Hisoka and Luffy? Please share with us in the comments who you think would win in such a matchup. Keep liking and subscribing to the channel. We might just release a Hisoka-Luffy battle. If you enjoyed this video, then definitely check out this next one.